Hi, and thanks for watching. In this video, we'll learn about group types and their uses. Group types are categories of groups that may visit your organization. Once group types are configured, they can be assigned to group sales reservation itineraries, and you can report on them. For example, if you want to report on all of the grade levels of all of your school groups, you can create a group type for each grade level and then report on it. To set up new group types, we'll first go to Tickets, then click Group Sales Setup. Then from here, we'll click Group Types. Here you'll see all current group types in All True. To add a new one, we'll click Add, and then type the name of the group type. Click OK to save your group type. Once you've created group types, you can also associate required resources with them to streamline the reservation process. Creating a required resource means when a reservation is created with the group type, the resources will be automatically added to their reservation as well. To create a new group type resource requirement, we will go back to the group sales setup area and click group type resource requirements. To create new group type resource requirements, click add. First, we'll choose the group type and then we'll add the required resources. You'll also need to add the quantity needed if the number of resources is not automatically calculated. Keep in mind, group type resource requirements are optional. You should only use this if the resources are the same for that group type every time. When creating group reservations, you can now assign a group type to your itinerary. To report on group types, you can use the Group Sales Revenue Report. To go to that report, go to Sales, and under Reports, click Group Sales Revenue. In the Group Sales Revenue Report, you can select which groups to report on by checking and unchecking the boxes. Click View Report to see the report. In addition to the Group Sales Revenue Report, you can also build queries that use group types as a filter, as well as include group types in query results. Group types can also be included as a merge field in group sales contracts as well. That's all for this video. Thanks for watching.